Hey, welcome to Thoughts on the Porch. Again, heat waves, staying inside and not going outside. So uh, I've been trying to get off the politics, but uh, couldn't do that much longer. So the key is uh, today, the phrase of the day is, come on, man. This little son of a bitch from northern Illinois illegally takes a gun that he owned illegally over the state line to illegally hunt protesters. Let's be clear. If you're 17, you're not allowed to own an AR. That's not, that's a law. Sorry, it's a law. Number two, if you leave your home in Illinois to cross state lines with a gun, you're not going to protect. You are not going to protect. You're going hunting. Okay? If a black kid walked into those protests with a rifle, he'd be dead. If a black kid walked into that protest with a squirt gun, he'd be dead. A white kid with an AR from out of state with an illegally owned gun that he's not allowed to operate gets handed a bottle of water from the police. So next time someone says, oh, racism is dead, oh, Barack Obama's crazy, look at the face of the kid who takes a gun from his home in Illinois, brings it to Kenosha, kills two people, wounds another, doesn't even get harassed by the police. They don't even arrest him. He doesn't even get arrested there. Come on, man. Everyone's making these jokes about, you don't want to get shot by the police. Comply. Put your hands up. Don't talk back. Cooperate. Bullshit. You don't want to get shot by the police. Don't be black. Because if you're black, your chances are elevated. If you're white, you're probably safe. Come on, man. Enough. Enough. That's it. Enough. Let's stop killing black kids, black men, black women, and little black kids like Tamir Rice. Black women like Sandra Bland. Let's just stop fucking doing it, man. That's it. That's it. Come on, man. Enough. And let's stop making jokes about it. And let's stop making light of it. And let's stop letting the media bend the truth. Come on, man. You can do this. You know how I know? Because you're beautiful.